What's good, YouTube? It's your boy R. Welcome back to AM Island. But I hope you guys are doing good. I'm doing right here. Back with another reaction video. Today we're gonna be reacting to Yo Yo 808. Another video of his. She fell for me. All right. I guess this is a Tinder story. Damn. Okay. Tinder horror story. Bad. I was just about to say. Oh gosh. Get out of me, demon. Uh, pause. I was gonna say, I never had no good experience with uh, meeting people on Tinder. I'm gonna tell you guys my Tinder story after he finishes one. I'm gonna see if his one is as bad as my one. But if you guys are new to the channel, man, smash that button, subscribe, comment down below. We're on the road to 1,000 subscribers, but. Oh, oh shit! Oh. Excuse me, that damn burp like it was fighting me just now. Oh, let's get into it. It works. The, the date ends and she's like, I really don't want this to end. No one's home right now. We should go over to my place. Oh shit. I think my neighbors hate me. So I recently made and deleted a video talking about how I've been slacking on the channel. And I gave a number of reasons why. Well, one of, if not the main reason I was slacking was because I downloaded Tinder. And if you follow me on Instagram, you'll know that I animated 50% of my last video in the span of 20 hours. Well, that was only possible because of the immense strength I gained in my thumbs from the hours and hours of swiping I did on the stupid waste of it. And I already hear you guys in the comments. But yo yo, you don't like online dating, why don't you go talk to women in real life? No. So needless to yeah. say, a couple uh, interesting Tinder stories to tell. So one night I'm scrolling away on Tinder and I see this girl. The thing that stood up to me was the fact that she was an artist. So I swiped right and to my surprise, when we matched, she immediately Text me, bro, if you look up into the sky, you could visibly see a hole in the ozone forming by how much this girl was gassing me up. She's complimenting my heart, my hair, everything, so I match energy and we end up texting for a little while. But if there's one thing about me, I am a much better FaceTimer than I am a texter. So I ask for her number, I shoot her a call, and I'm flirting it up, we're joking and laughing. We plan to meet the next Saturday, this was on a Sunday night, so throughout that week, I'm talking to her when I can to keep her interested, but it's it's kind of hard because I'll randomly dip on the conversations for hours at a time so I can work on my animations. But I also yeah, yeah, yeah. want to tell her about my channel so I don't tell her why I'm gone. Not the best strategy, but it's working. Fast forward yeah. a couple days. You don't want to up on Saturday. I get dressed, I go to brush my teeth, and I'm shaking. Why? Am I nervous? I look in the mirror and realize I'm sweating. I'm breathing heavily, my eyes are dilated. I look down, my legs are shaking more than... Don't do it, don't do it, don't do it, don't do it. A person using an airplane bathroom. Uh... I try to calm myself down. What? what do I look like being nervous? I don't even know this girl's last name. I had some free time before the date. Bro, so I started that, recording you should know first name. I to call my nerves. I sit down, turn on my microphone, and since my videos aren't... The quietest of videos. I always like to yell into the microphone to make sure my audio is. Yeah! I'm the liar! <laughs> yo, yo. I'm the liar. You like to do that shit for real. Like, just now, I think, you know, uh, that's the game yell out of no fucking well. Had me pitch up to turn the volume down. My fr freaking neighbors might come beat me one of these days. They come in my apartment and jump me. I can blame you, yo, yo. Mm -hmm. As I freaking talk, my boy scream. I didn't have my headphones plugged into my computer, meaning my scream was picked up on my microphone, played through the speaker, picked up from the microphone again, and played through the speakers, resulting in this horribly loud, distorted sound, causing my ears to ring like crazy. So there I am, laying on the floor, in a ball, in my closet, and then... Ah! For the day. Oh my so gosh, stop, stop, stop. Okay, I don't know if y'all noticed, right? I have... PTSD for this ringtone. I know it might sound crazy, but you're like, all right, how do you have PTSD for a ringtone? Listen, I have to get up in the morning, 4.40 in the morning to go for work. I still, of course, I have a full-time job. So some morning it required me to get up 4.40 in the morning. And this is my particular ringtone. I hate it so much, right? That's why it's head as my ringtone, so I can actually get up out of bed. So if I hear the ringtone anywhere outside my sleep, I always flinch. 
I always freaking flinch, man. Because I hate the freaking rain tool so much. And like right now, I feel like I got at like, see how it just went up? I got to get ready for work. I got to go get ready for work. But don't worry. It ain't always be like that. Yeah, sorry. The most I can. I head out. We meet at the okay. sushi place. We sit down and get to talking, but I'm still nervous. All the things that went down this morning caused me to be a little in my head. And I'm talking way differently in person than I was over FaceTime. <laughs> hey, talking like that, we gonna fight when I see you. Hey, you're here. Uh, oh, you wanted to hunt? Uh, my bad. Oh, was good. What you been up to? So, uh, the talking all that shit on the phone. How was your How was your day? <clears throat> Stop playing, show. You know you bad. I, yo, FaceTime me from your computer too, so I can see those eyes with your language. That's a cool mask. Is it Naruto? Oh, oh Demon Slayer? Oh, uh, I haven't. I haven't watched that yet. It, it was just not looking good for me, yo. I was just too deep in my head to be myself. And honestly, I'm usually really good at first impressions, but for some reason with this girl, I. She was cute. Go ahead. Go ahead. Sit. But if there is one good thing about being a storyteller for a living, if the combo with the person gets dry, I literally have a catalog of fully fleshed out, memorized stories in my head. So I, I was thinking about that. And I tell them the story of me accidentally eating that edible. And we actually start laughing and the positive feedback makes me calm down a bit and relax. And I think she realizes that I'm comfortable so she gets comfortable too. And just like that, the conversation is flowing and we're laughing and joking. The food gets here, I start eating and then I hear, and honestly, I can't believe she said that, right? Oh, she, whoa, was she talking? Yeah, and then he was like, wow, are you really gonna do that? And honestly, I can't believe they were talking. Whoa, whoa, is she talking right now? I take another bite and realize something horrible. I can't hear and chew at the same time. I think the audio messed up from earlier messed up my hearing because oh. I can only hear my chewing. But now I'm in trouble because I can't just stop eating, but I also can't come clean about my hearing because I don't want to tell this girl about my channel. So throughout this okay. conversation, I just say, yeah. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Just move over to the over, other side of the booth. Over again. So she can think you won't get closer to her too. And it worked. The, the date ends and she's like, I really don't want this to end. No one's home right now. You should go over to my place. Pull up. I know, hey, just the part right here is when you start screaming. <laughs> See, why is that you? I don't know. The girl was out hearing a word that she said. You sure don't got nothing on me. Alright. I look at her and I'm just like, I was so nervous about this date, but this is going so well. This girl is amazing. Girl. And I followed her. Never watch out. This girl trips and lands clean on her face <laughs> on the concrete. I rush over to help her. No, 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 no. Are you good? Can, let me help you. She darts up and looks me in the face, and I kid you not, says, You should make a YouTube video about this. I should what? Pause. That's we can go back a little bit. Ain't there some shit? You're deaf. She blind. <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> Ain't that some shit? <laughs> you can't hear and she can't fucking see where she going. Hey, <laughs> y'all better don't have no children. Cause that could be a fucking <laughs> Yeah, I can be a whole different type of story. Oh my gosh! And it's another thing. You such a gent yo. He's a gentleman. You walk. You run to help her. I swear, to God. I put this on everything I love. If she dropped in front of me, I don't care how fine she is, how big her titties is, how pretty her feet is, how fat her butt is. I am laughing in her face. Oh my mama! D listen. <laughs> I laugh in her face. Like if I don't see no blood, I can laugh harder. I'm sorry, that's just me, I just, I just cracky. But no, listen up, once I, once I get the laugh, I'm running over, you okay? You know, let me help y'all, let me help y'all. I'm a laugh while I help her out. And if she laughing, I ain't gonna lie, we, man, that's, that's like a little bond. That's how I know, man, I can kick it with you. Me and you is the same. You, know, you shouldn't be laughing at me because if I fall down, I expect you to laugh. Because I laugh myself. I was like, boy. What? Come on, man. Stop it. But the YouTube thing. How does she know about my No, are, are you good? 
she gets up, yeah, yeah, no, no, I'm fine, but well, wasn't that funny? <laughs> you should definitely make an animation about that. Ah. She's a cloud demon. That's what this was. We walk towards the Uber to go to her place, and the whole time, she's just going on and on and on about how she's never been animated before. And I'm just like, this girl really just fell face first. On content. For a video? Just to make a cameo in an animation. Honestly, to and this what day, though? I have no clue how she found me. When I talk to girls, and what I do though? a pretty good job of hiding it. Anyways, we get to the Uber, and I tell her I'm tired and I better get going. She tried to convince me to go, but I was done at that point. I dap her up. Yes, I dap her up, and I head home. I go to sleep, and since this, I have not talked to her since. I was just weird, honestly. And also, if you think I gave her what she wanted, Nah, I completely changed her race, appearance, and everything in this animation. Believe it or not, oh. this was a more light tender story. I got Uh, cause I was saying. I know some blue demons, I feel like I'm Zuko. I can drop four five, I be playing Uno. First I put a mask on, and a doom. Put a nigga's face in a box like Oh my god, I just dabbed. No, 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 I gotta stop I just dabbed. Sorry. Uh-uh, uh-uh. But you know, listen though. She's a cloud demon though, but yo yo is such a good guy. I like that. He's such a gentleman. I would fuck the shit out of her on God. I'm oh, I shouldn't have said it like that. I would have clapped them cheeks on God. It's ready. I say, oh. I'd have clapped them cheeks and hit it and quit it. I'd have hit it and do the dash, boy. He's a good guy. I respect that man. I respect that. I think this world need that's a good thing, because this world need balance. This world, this world need people like me. And people like Yo-Yo, who actually care about her feelings. That's good, that's good. He ain't like, he, see, he better than me. Like I said, he better than me. <laughs> oh, <let> me <laughs> oh, gosh. Just a lot going on. He's a good guy, though. I, I, that's all I can say. He's a good guy. I wouldn't have done it, but you're a good guy. Boy, I'd have, oh, oh, I'd have show, I'd have show her animation all right. Shoot, YouTube. <laughs> I let us, I let us, I let her pull on my pink dress, but keep playing me. Mm, you like that? You wanna drop all your fish? And over. I say stop playing. Okay, let's keep this PG. Yeah, keep this PG. Keep this PG. But yeah, um, my Tinder meetup, right? Let me take my one quick. Uh, my Tinder meetup was weird. She tried to move in. Oh, don't think I'm joking. Listen. I swear I'm like a goat. Anyway, so we meet up. Um, I this is where I went wrong. I felt like I invited her over to my place too quick. Um, we talk, you know, what you what we do. I told her, um, what you doing, what what to do, come spend the day. And I saw she came with a backpack. So I'm like, okay, cool, because I travel with a backpack too. So she came with a backpack and she put it I can't. I have like this little pantry, little, little cabinet space right in the corner on this side. But I keep my laundry, tur my detergents, and my towels, and whatever, whatever. So, um, you know, we do have what we do. We chill out, we spend the day, right? And I had, um, what's it called? I had PT PTDS, post my nose. P it's P, P, I had PNS, post nut syndrome. That's what I had, right? So anyway, now she, you know, PNS. So I'm, I'm, she got to go wash up now and go bed. I'm a funny guy. I don't like people use my soap. So what I did was went to the same, like, like I think I have my little laundry stuff right there. I just keep my soap bars in there too. So I went to get home, home, home personal soap. You know, so I'm getting soap and I saw the bag. The bag was open. My she getting ready to go in the shower. I saw the bag open and I saw a bunch of clothes. So I'm like, huh? It was, I still ain't mine. I still ain't stressing. I saw a bunch of clothes and shoes, and some shoes, right? So I was like, boy, that's a lot of fucking clothes. But anyhow, mind my business, keep going, right? Mind you, I ain't going to the bag. The bag was literally open, so, and like, the look down, it was there. So anyhow, I give her, so, sun getting set. Mind you, this is Corona time. Corona, roaming to the streets. We had a curfew. We had a six o'clock curfew. I see five, four o'clock come. She ain't talking about going. Four thirty come. She ain't going nowhere. Five o'clock coming, she ain't going nowhere. Five fifteen coming, she ain't going nowhere. Five ten or something. You know, going home to your child? Oh, she got a child. 
Don't worry about that. So she was like, oh, I guess thinking about spending the night. I don't know you like that mess. No, 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 no. You, you got to go. I think I should stay. You can't. So she stopped. I didn't hear that. All I wanted is, miss, I have PNS. I want you to go on from, I had I, 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 I had PNS from, say, 1 o'clock. I want you to go on from 1 or 2. And you're still here. So, anyway. So, she ran it on. So, I said, you know what, after this. So, I called my cousin. I said, yo, cause, call me in five minutes and tell me we got to go on the road quick before curfew. So, she didn't spend the night, that's all that matters. But anyhow, <laughs> oh my god, I'm a, I'm a terrible human. But I don't care, she's done the same thing to me. It is what it is. But that's the end of this video, man. If you guys want me to do a full detail on that story, let me know in the comment. I'll do a full time story time, of course. But this is the end of the video, man. If you guys are new to the channel, man, smash that like button, subscribe, comment down below. We're on the road to 1,000 subscribers. Show your boy some love. Whatever being said, have a good time, have a good day. And the world is yours. Peace. I'm out.